Hello gamer, today I will show you how to fix Antilion mod mic USB if not working mic or its sound is crackling. This tutorial can also be useful for other mic repair. To repair mic you have to find the place where the cable is broken. In my case if I move the wire near to remove, the mic starts working shortly. To do this you will need to borrow a set of soldering tools, super glue and some heating tubing from your grandmother. The first task is to cut the cable at the point of damage. In this place it looks like the brace is damaged. I will put heating tubing over the top to make sure this part lasts longer. Cut a long and knocked heating tubing, use the pliers to make it bigger to fit on the mic mount. Attach the heating tubing so that the cable is locked in place. Then with a sharp knife remove cable jacket, but carefully, not to damage the internal wires. Then for each wires remove the outer jacket so that these wires can be thin. With a multimeter check that both wires reach the mic capsule. You can open the mic housing and check each wire separately to see if they are healthy from one end to the other end. Put the mic housing back together, then carefully open the mic remote control, but be extra careful because you will have to put this remote control back together after repair. Remove the main board from the housing. Cut off the damaged wires. Then remove the old wires from the rubber, as you will need to pull the new cable through this rubber. Cleaning the cable protector rubber will not be easy, but is needed. Then cut off several hitching tubing, stretch them big enough to fit on both the rubber and the remote housing. Put all the hitching tubing on the cable as you won't be able to do this after soldering. Then thin the wires to make it easier to solder to the board contacts. Put the rubber on the cable. If it doesn't fit you can try to stretch the rubber bigger or glue the cable jacket with the super glue and then put rubber part on. Then unsolder the old wires and solder the new wires in place. But be careful to solder the colors exactly where they should be. If you mess up the contacts the mic not won't work. Put the board back in place to see how far you need to put the rubber part. Glue the cable with super glue so it doesn't come out and break the wires. Check that the remote housing can be put back together and nothing is in the way. Place the super glue on the edge of the housing and glue the housing closed. Then put the glue on the cable and rubber and attach the first hitching tubing over the top. Then attach the second hitching tubing. This together will give a good fixing of the cable. Put the hitching tubing on the other side too. Then put the big hitching tubing on top of the housing. Do the same on the other side of the remote. Together this will give a good cable and remote fixation. Here's the result. Mod mic USB fixed. Money and time saved so I can get back to gaming. Good luck.